hello and welcome back to my channel it is a new day um today it's gonna be a really interesting day i am in my current bedroom and i am about to put up a possible fragrance wall we're going to try this is something that i've been doing a ton of research on and i finally found something that i think i'll love i mean i'm hoping i will love it um but anyway yeah we're gonna put it up right there i have all the stuff right there to get it done so i guess we're just gonna get into it i actually have my mom here helping me because this could go you know i don't think it'll go bad i just think i need help because the wall is taller than me so there's that quick little outfit check before we get started i have on my anine bing sweatshirt which i love i am obsessed with and i have on some carbon 38 leggings i got my little nike flip-flops with my nike socks popping off because this this is about to be a sport today so yeah here is the wall the empty space that we're going to use for the wall um and those are the racks i guess it's um i guess it's like a bookcase that's what that's what it is it's a bookcase and here are the glass um the glass shelves so it should be interesting i'm actually really excited because being in this industry the fragrance industry like so many people ask me all the time like okay girl so how do you store your perfume where do you store it before so i'm in a new place i've moved here in 2000 like right before right before the pandemic hit and like literally like days before they shut down everything and i have my perfume in boxes some of it is on a rack downstairs in the dungeon my basement and um yeah i i've never really took the time to kind of figure out what i want to do and where i want to do it for now it'll be right here until we move into a bigger and better house so yeah i think we should just go ahead and get started i'm excited and nervous but let's do it it's also valentine's day and this is something that i got for my mom for valentine's day i think she'll be excited okay so i have the glass pieces laid out on my bed these are the shelves this is enough for one shelf um one bookcase and this these are for the other so we're gonna open this box right now this is the big box and by big i mean like really really big yeah let's see. it goes all the way out into the hallway this is like at least six feet Not heavy though. So this I got from um, CB2. Just so you know, I will link it in the description if you like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> which you're going to have to investigate in a bit. And then the case. Is that one piece? This is one piece. Wow. Okay, here's the case. Whew. 
was a lot. <laughs> that was a wow. lot. That's one. That's one. Now we got one more to go. One more to go. <laughs> oh boy. I'm actually recording store um, a TikTok and a reel for obviously IG and TikTok. So that's why I'm shooting over here. <laughs> so in directions, which is important. So. Yes. We don't want no pieces left over when we finish with this project. Yeah, no screws left over because this is going to, that's what I'm nervous about. Like, I have a lot of perfume, so maybe some of this might be just like a vanity shot, but like, for the most part, I have a lot of fragrance, you know? Oh, I think I have it upside down. Damn it. Yeah, looking at it. Yeah. Okay, we're turning it. Turning, turning, turning. So... Maybe some of my fragrances will go here, not all of them. But, uh, you know, we'll see. We'll see. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> At this point, we're starting to, well, of course, first, you want to make sure you read the directions, right? This is a little tricky, um, but we're starting to drill these mounts into the sides, and it's coming out quite nicely. This is what it looks like so far up against the wall. So I am still. <laughs> don't laugh. I am still um. screwing stuff in, but I finally got it going together. I had made a mistake, so I had to screw, unscrew some stuff and then re-screw it in the right way. So I did that and now I'm finally down to my last screw. This goes on top of this. I don't even know the terms of these things, but it's bigger than that as I go along. One thing I must say though, I do recommend if you have an actual drill, use an actual drill. Don't use like the little drill that they give you, one of these, because this does nothing. And you can't tighten stuff. And then if you over tighten it, you can like damage the product. So better to have a drill. Okay. So, what a process this was. I mean, typically I like to, you know, put together, put together things because I do feel like I'm very handy and I do feel like I do a good job at getting things done. But this was a severe challenge. I mean, it's always tricky when you're dealing with like houses and like putting things together because the wall will be uneven or, you know, or, 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 or there's always something that kind of gets you tripped up. And today that's what it was for me. The wall was kind of uneven and then finding the studs so that this could mount perfectly into the wall. But so far, so good. It's looking pretty good. We'll see. We have to work on this one because we ran into an issue with this particular joint up here. Um, but I think it looks really cute. Um, I think it's gonna look really nice when once my perfume and stuff is up there. But what a challenge trying to get it put together. My God. Ugh. And then the other part to it too is like, Okay, you're drilling holes in a wall. Now there's like crud on the floor. And this is all like you can see the fingerprints and like the dust and stuff like it needs to be washed. Yeah, whatever that is. I guess it's like a sticker that we tried to remove. Yeah, and fingerprints like you can see it's like dirty now, but it's fine. Um, it's a work in progress. Note to self next time, just hire someone to get it done. Like I said, typically I don't mind doing it because I do feel like a deep sense of accomplishment once I'm done doing it, knowing that I put it up myself, but totally not worth it here. This is taking me all day and I'm not happy about it. Crisis averted. We've got the screws in. See, the energy is very different now. <laughs> energy is very different. We've 
got the screws in. So I haven't published this video yet, but I will hopefully by the time that this video is up. I helped my mom do over her closets. We did over um, two closets in the bedroom and we did a uh, clothing closet, down, a uh, coat closet downstairs. And we use the Alpha system with the container store. Absolutely love it. It's so, so good. It's really great. It, it's easy, right? They make it super easy and the materials are high quality. So that being said, what we had to do was pull from one of the screws, screw systems from the Alpha system to use it here. And actually I think I did it for two screws and so worth it, much more sturdier. Maybe eventually if I run into any issues with like it getting wobbly, I will replace the whole thing as far as the screws, but this is pretty much good to go. I think we're all set. Um, I'm very happy now I can just put in the shelves and we should be good to go. nothing major but it does make a major difference we're just painting over some dings on the walls um they might have been here before um sometimes you just get scratches on a wall from just like moving things around and stuff like that but we're just doing like a quick little coat of paint where there are scuffs and then i don't know i already cleaned this one i have to clean that one and then we should be good to go. All right, so the wall is set up. We are finally done with it. Thank you, God. It was a little challenging. That screw up there gave me a bit of trouble, but it's up and now we can start to put some fragrances on it. I'm not sure if I want to do fragrances like fragrances by color or fragrances by category even like gourmand citruses or you could do men versus women we could do niche versus designer we could do like i said the color combination we could do by brands you know i have a lot of different fragrances so i'm not sure how i want to organize it just yet i do have some ideas um but yeah i don't know so we started putting some fragrances up just so you can see what i have so far totally not gonna stay like this i'm sure but we've got some different things here we've got replica we've got aura bay we've got some cartier um i think this is boo uh pronounced boo house of boo got some Tom Ford up here then I'm just mixing it up over here with some fragrances that I have obviously Baccarat, Kayali, got some Maison, Crivelli, Victor and Rolf this is the new one so much to choose from and honestly when I tell you this is like what would you say five percent maybe ten percent <laughs> of what I have not even one percent yeah so this is just a small amount of what i have we're gonna have to be prayerful about it we're gonna have to hope it all works out um i might get one more of these just because i feel like i don't know it might be necessary but anyway we'll see how it goes when we start packing things up later but anyway yeah just a quick update 